Hey guys, it's Steph, and today we are doing a Starbucks video. I just spent 30 bucks at Starbucks because I'm going to try your guys' drinks and see if I can find a new favorite or see if I don't like any of them. <laughs> I'm not that picky, but you guys like to know what I like. Ice caramel macchiato. Mm, yep, and thank God I did in-store pickup because that line is insane. So I'm going to order pickup. Oh, do they do, oh I know, I was gonna say, do they do curbside? So I ordered five drinks. I'm going to go inside and grab them really quick. I'm gonna keep my car on. I'll be back. Cardboard tray secured. Look at all of these drinks. Ooh. Oh my, oh my. You guys, I do not know what is up with my camera mounts recently. I don't know, maybe it's because it's cold out. It's like not sticking. But my camera is gonna break, like, <laughs> Literally, I don't know how it has it. Also, my car is really out of gas. Shall I turn it off? I kept it on when I went into the store. I guess I shouldn't have done that because it. I showed up like 15 minutes late and on the, she was just starting to make my drinks. So I had to wait like 10 more minutes. I was like, my car is running out of gas. Oops. Who else? takes their car all the way down to E. So thank you to everyone who sent me in their favorite go-to Starbucks drink, and let's read off the ones I got. So thank you to Mia. We got a mango dragon fruit refresher with vanilla sweet cream cold foam. Okay, so this one's super simple, but I was like, ooh, the color. I don't know if I've ever had the mango dragon fruit. Like, look how pretty it is. It's so pretty. And I love the sweet cold foam, so I was like, let's try this one out. Let's do a fruity one, because we, we can't do all coffee. So I wanted to get a variety. Okay, next up, this one right here. Ooh, the top of this one looks delicious. Thank you to Gomana for this one. She said, hey, okay, so order tall iced white mocha, add extra salted caramel cream cold foam with caramel and mocha drizzle and a little caramel syrup. Ooh tongue twisters so this was easy to do all on the app though but like this one looks super good what was that <laughs> she like locking her car so many times <laughs> that's so funny okay next one is from Brittany iced coffee extra ice in a grande cup, I couldn't do that on the app. Uh, two pumps of white chocolate, two pumps of caramel, extra sweet cream, cold foam. Oh yeah, look at all that cold foam. And caramel drizzle. It doesn't even taste like coffee. I know you will love it. So, I don't even see like any of the drizzles in the, in the cup. It's like my favorite when you could see the caramel and chocolate like just dripping down the sides of the cup. It's always like delicious. Ooh, this one looks super cool. Okay, look at this. <gasps> Ooh, these all kind of like match my nails a little bit, like in a way. <laughs> so this one right here is the Captain Crunch Frappe. So get a tall strawberries and cream frappuccino, half a pump of caramel syrup, one pump of toffee syrup, half a pump of hazelnut syrup, add java chips, and this is from Column. Ooh, it honestly smells like Captain Crunch. That's exciting. Okay, and last one here is an iced matcha with two pumps of toffee nut syrup from Samantha. Mmm, honestly, every time I try and get the toffee nut syrup, it's always sold out, but today it was not sold out, so I'm excited to give it a try. So they were out of straws inside, so we're using a Chick-fil-A straw. <laughs> I'm like, this red looks so weird with the Starbucks cup. I was gonna say, where's the Starbucks logo? There used to be a green logo on the cup. They got rid of that a long time ago, but I kind of liked that. The OG. Okay, first we're gonna try this one because I love the top with all that syrup and all the sweet foam. We don't need a straw for this one. Whoa. It kind of tastes like cookie dough, I don't know why. This was the tall iced white mocha with caramel mocha. Oh, a salted caramel cold foam. I never even knew that they had that. When I saw that DM, I was like, there's no way. Like maybe you're from a different country and you guys have like different stuff at your Starbucks. Cause I saw McDonald's, I believe in Canada has poutine fries. Like what? We don't have that here. And then um, in Paris, McDonald's had chicken wings. Like everything's so different everywhere. But, ooh, uh, mm, I love that. That's the best sweet salt, cold foam. What is it called? 
sweet cream, sweet cream cold foam. Salted caramel sweet cream cold foam. Holy hell. Mm. Oh, I love the little saltiness. Like, I really like that. I never knew that was a thing. What drink is that usually on? They need, like, a salted caramel iced coffee. They don't need... I don't have that. Mmm. Like you lick your lips after and it's like a little bit of saltiness. Okay, starting off to a great start. I know I'm gonna wanna keep drinking that one after this video. Cause I usually, you know, I finish one of them. Like whatever one I like the best. And then if I can give any of them to someone or I'll put them in my fridge and then if I don't like them, I'm like, oh well. Okay, next let's try this color for one. The Captain Crunch strawberry cream frappuccino. I'm not a huge person into sweet stuff, but I'm gonna still try it for you guys. Wow. Wow. That's good. I'm like chewing little bits of strawberry. At first I was like, what am I chewing? That is really good. It tastes like the milk left over. Honestly, from any fruity cereal, like fruity pebbles, fruit loops. Mmm. I never order frappuccinos. Wow. This is like really refreshing. Like, I don't like strawberry strawberry milk. I don't really like strawberry ice cream, none of that. But this is just like kind of like a blueberry taste. Why is it giving blueberry vibes? I don't know. Mmm. Okay, two for two. Literally tastes like cereal milk. I have a candle, and that's called cereal milk. <laughs> Like what an interesting like flavor that we all like like to drink your milk after it has cereal oh, I haven't had cereal in like years You guys I feel like my hair is already kind of like growing from that last video I did or a couple ago I think when I was wrapping presents I was like I can't wear my hair down like she cut it so short I don't like it I feel like I can't style it But I feel like after like a couple weeks have gone by probably two almost three yeah, three. It has been over three because I got my hair done when I got my nails done and I already re-got my nails done after three weeks. But I got Opalex shampoo because I heard that makes your hair really healthy and grow. So I ordered number three, four, and five. Three is like a hair treatment. Three and four are shampoo and conditioner. It's confusing. There was like number one, number two, number seven. And then I also got like a hair oil. So I'm really excited to try that out. I will let you guys know how that goes, but it'll probably come in like a week. And then you guys can watch my hair process because I will be using that all the time we'll see if it grows really quick because i would love to have it long again for summer it is long but you know what i mean okay this one has a lot of cold foam so this is just the iced coffee caramel caramel drizzle lots of foam and some caramel syrup as well inside i think this needs mixed up Where's the straw? Oh, there it is. I feel like... I feel like it needs mixed. It has lots of foam. Oh, yeah. All, like, the coffee was sitting on top. If I mix it, that might make it better. You know, I think I'm not liking it because it's just iced coffee. It's not like that bougie ice vanilla white mocha chai latte cocoa banana no, caramel latte 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 mocha caramel 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 and extra caramel please and that'll be 1500 calories later and 25.99 <laughs> like i'm already getting hyper from coffee <sighs> i just had like a spaz attack it's not bad but it's like really like strong tasting and i like it like really sweet it's not bad though Maybe I'm tasting the caramel brulee pumps in here. Oh, and two pumps white mocha. I know I love the white mocha though. 
Okay, well, this is the least favorite so far. It's not bad. Like, I would definitely drink it if someone, like, gave it to me. But. Next one. This green one. This is healthy because it's green. We're going to act like it's a kale and spinach and celery smoothie. Or whatever those things are people drink. Celery juice. Mmm. I hate these lids. I hate them. I just choke on ice every time I sip out of them. I hate them. <laughs> like, ice just goes in my mouth. I'm not going to swallow the ice whole. But then it looks like I'm just chewing on my drink. This is very good. Very milky and creamy. I do like the... Uh, what is this? Matcha with some toffee nut. Mmm, yeah. Gives it a little bit of a nutty taste, and it's super creamy. And this one's actually not bad for you. I think the tall said it was like 100-something calories, and then like a pump of syrup. So this one's actually not bad. And the last one to try is another fruity one. Ooh, this is like such a pretty color. I love this color. It's like kind of like cotton candy. Okay. To be honest, it's refreshing, it's good, but it tastes like an alcoholic drink. It literally tastes like like a really flavorful White Claw that's not carbonated, like a raspberry White Claw that isn't carbonated with also some raspberry Ciroc in it. Like it's very fruity, but it tastes like an alcoholic drink. So in that case, I wouldn't want to be drinking this unless it was an alcoholic drink on the weekend you know oh this would be perfect at the beach like this is like a drink you'd get in mexico at the beach like mm, yeah no it's good it is like lemonade -y tasting oh megan dragon fruit oh dragon fruit i see where the color came from i see i love dragon fruit because of the color. I once bought a dragon fruit and I cut into it and it was white on the inside and I was really disappointed. But I guess there's like multiple dragon fruits. Whoa, this zipper is kind of low. This shirt's super comfy though. I still have the tag on it though because I can't decide if I like, like it. It's from Abercrombie. It just came in the mail yesterday and I was like, do I like it? Okay, now for the final judging. You guys already know what I'm going to say first is the best. The first one I tried. Everyone order this. Tall iced white mocha with caramel drizzle, mocha drizzle, and salted caramel cold foam. Mmm. It's that saltiness I'm like loving. And it's just super creamy and caramely. This one's my favorite. Second favorite, the healthy one. <laughs> Just kidding, like none of these are healthy, but we don't care. This green one's my second favorite. Third favorite is the strawberry one that's supposed to be Captain Crunch. This one's super good. And then I like, um, if it was summertime, this one. If it was just like a regular day, I think I would get this one. These are kind of tied. And like I said, they're all not bad. And I thank you all for sending in your drinks. I'm not judging you for any of your drinks. <laughs> like everyone has different taste buds, which is like crazy. How like we all taste things so differently. Like some people love the fruity and some people like like darker black coffee. Some people like it super sweet. It's like also like, do you like candy or do you like chocolate better? like sour candy not really my thing but chocolate oh love it well i hope you guys are all having a fantastic day go treat yourself to a coffee always treat yourself gotta treat yourself it makes the day more fun like oh i gotta 
I got a fun drink. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up if you want to keep seeing me try out your guys' favorite things to order at places. Also, make sure you subscribe if you're new and click my notification bell so you guys get notified when I upload. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.